Welcome to another Gary's Mod tutorial. In this one, um, I'll be showing you how to mess around with cameras. Um, first, just let you know if you ever have lag or anything like that, uh, it might be because of a bunch of objects. Uh, you can go here, user, clean up, clean up everything, and everything will be gone. And it acts a lot smoother. Alright, so now what we can do is we can take. Let's go ahead and make our rocket again because I want to show you how this works. Let's go back here, let's create our rocket, bring it up in the air. You know, you know how to do this. I mean, if you watch my other videos, thruster, choose this one, all that good stuff. Place it, bring it back down. Oh, yeah, another funny thing um, if you ever hate a certain character, let's say if you hate Mr. Cool. If you don't know who Mr. Cool is, this is who Mr. Cool is. You'll, you should go. <laughs> he just slammed his face in the ground. You gotta check out this other video. Look up Elliot goes to school. Anyway, so let's take a rope. Let's click on his face. Let's click on that. Um, you can change how the rope looks. Just let you know. For example, that looks like a cable. This looks like an actual rope. All right. So now that we have our weird rocket of death thing going on for these guys. Um, what you can do, let's say you're making a machine or something like that, and you want to uh, have a camera follow these guys as they're flipping out and about. You can go ahead and come down here to where it says cameras, and you could spawn a camera. Let's say you spawn it right there, and then let's right click on this guy. Okay, so now if we hit zero, we'll go right to the camera, just like that, see? So we can have toggle, or we can just hold it and then it'll do that. Um, what we can also, okay, now that we have that, what is, what is RT monitor? Place an RT monitor. Um, render target. Okay, that's another thing. If you ever want to, like, watch yourself, I don't know. But, um, like, uh, you can place a, a render target camera, and in the top left-hand corner, you can see me aiming directly at it and all that type of stuff, as you can see right there. And you can see it on your little tool gun in the... See, you can see me running around and all that fun stuff. So that's another thing that I just thought I would show you. You can have it looking directly at you. It, it'll follow you around like that, or you can click there, and it'll just... So if you left-click, it'll just look where you're looking. If you right-click, it'll follow you. See how it's following me wherever I go? In the top left hand corner? Or the bottom right? It works that way too. Alright. So now that we have this little contraption of death type thing here, let's go ahead and hit zero and let's watch this. See? And after we make the rocket go, it'll follow th this person specifically. So this will be good if you're ever like making a machinima or anything like that. Another thing you can do is if you hit zero again, you can scroll through or just hit six and go to camera. If you left click, it'll take a picture. I don't, I don't know where the pictures go though. If you right click, you can tilt it or you can zoom in. Like, so you can tilt it sideways, left, right, with your mouse. But if I move my mouse forward, like I'm looking up, then it'll zoom in and I can zoom out just like that. See where everything is like, whoa, weird, all that type of stuff. So that's how you use a camera. So yeah. That's how you use a camera in Gary's Mod to follow these guys flip out and move around and die and get slammed on the ground and all that fun stuff. So yeah, thanks for watching. This has been How to Use a Camera in Gary's Mod. Um, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.